So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The man who has taken first place here at Smash Factor 5. None, my friend, representing Nicaragua. How do you feel right now? Since you never show emotion anyway when you're on stage, so none of us know how do you feel. This it's feeling pretty, I'm feeling pretty good. My English might be rusty as hell right now because all of the Spanish I've been speaking lately. You speak so fluently. What are you saying? But, um, yeah, I, feel, I felt pretty good. Um, yeah. I kind of messed up in winners where I got that SD on, um, on FD. Yeah. But, um, I don't know, I mean, I just went to losers. I was like, I wasn't playing bad. It's just one mess up, and uh, I didn't let it get to me, you know. That's so good. I just brought it back that way. I have to say, man, it was really hype seeing you guys play. I had a conversation with Hugs earlier, mm -hmm. and uh, the stream knows this as well. Um, he said when he was playing your Captain Falcon, you know, he's just trying his best to win the battle on stage, you know, with, like just lock you down with like the jabs, the mm -hmm. F tilts. He was doing a really good job of that. And sometimes even calling out your, your run up grabs, like you would dash up to him and he would just down smash you. But, and then afterwards, he'll try to make sure to just close out the edge guards, which he was doing a really good job mm -hmm. of. But when it came to you picking Ganondorf, all of a sudden, he felt like there were a lot of question marks. He tried to play against Dream mm -hmm. to get a feel for it. But um, I wanted to know, what is the science behind none going Ganondorf? Because there are a lot of people that don't quite get it. Um, I don't know. Like, I, I was really annoyed. Like, when I play him, I get annoyed because I can't do anything with Falcon. I'm like, what's happening, you know? Like, he's really good at uh, shutting me down, like, yeah. mentally. Yeah. And um, I don't know. I think, like, I do have, like, a different play style with Ganon. I'm a bit more defensive. Mm -hmm. So I guess it's like a battle of defense. Okay. It's just neutral game because yeah. my problem with Falcon is I'm going aggro all the time. Mm -hmm. And with Ganon, I'm not so much, you know? But, um, like, with Ganon, there's, like, a few frame traps I do on him and um, a few things here and there that work out better. Oh, yeah. I mean, I, it was really, really hype to see how you're just, like, keeping him in place, you know, trying to control the pace of the match with a character who's so slow. I haven't seen you... Like, the match just started when you guys did your neutral start. You would start running across the stage all the way down till the edge so you could get that grab on him. And I'm like, wow, this guy's playing like Captain Falcon. Like, you know, dash dance and everything. Do you feel like you some of your Captain Falcon tendencies carry over to Ganondorf a little bit? Definitely. It works mm -hmm. both, both ways because I, I do some Ganon things on Falcon. Mm -hmm. And I do some Falcon things on Ganon. So I think they actually complement each other pretty good. Pretty awesome. Yeah. Pretty awesome, man. Well, um, I guess before we leave, if any of you guys have an awesome question to feed to us, Feel free to let us know, but um, what shout-outs do you have for the people, man? Feel free to shout-out anybody. Uh, shout-out to Canada. Mm -hmm. Shout-out to Nicaragua. Shout-out to Gamers in Espanol. Shout-out to Antonio Catarino, the, oh, the guy yeah. that got us all here. Man. True, I'm true. Like, I'm, I've been having a blast. Like This has definitely been one of the better tournaments I've ever gone to. Yeah, definitely a really fun time. And, you know, I heard that you'd be um, interested in actually streaming as well in the future. Where can people find you? Uh, yeah, people can fi find me at twitch.tv. Uh, slash none 13. So that's a uh, N0 Zero N? N E. Yeah. Okay. I should change that. It's hard to write, I guess. I don't know. Oh, it's all good, man. It's all good. And it looks like the people, they love you. They call it Captain Dorf, apparently. Captain Dorf. And yes, this guy is born from Nicaragua. Amazing player. Um, do you ha for the people that I guess doubt the viability of Captain Falcon and or Ganondorf, do you have any tips that um, can like get them on the right track? Um, just don't. Uh, double think yourself. Like if you if you're gonna do something, do it because you're confident in mm -hmm. doing it. Mm -hmm. And um, like definitely work on the mind games because tech skill isn't everything in melee. Sometimes you need a bit of mind games around here and there to to win. So um, I think he's a good character. I think he's that, but definitely viable. Yeah. But um, you have to look at him a bit differently. You know, play a bit more unique. I definitely respect it, man. Well, thank you again for your time you. and. I have to say, man, all the sets were super sick. Seeing you versus Javi before I let you go, mm -hmm. that was what, like one of the matches that I really wanted to see. Mm -hmm. You know what? We're going to extend the interview a little bit. Mm -hmm. what, what, what was going through your mind having to face Javi? I was pretty nervous because yeah. we only did friendlies once at Big House 6. Big House 5, sorry. Okay. Uh, it was like two or three friendlies. Like not even here we played friendlies. We were going in blind, basically. Yeah. So I guess it was basically just who adapted first. Mm -hmm. yeah. Really nice. But, um... He's definitely a sick fox. I like his fox a lot, and um, I don't know. I definitely enjoyed those two sets. They were definitely good. And, you know, not only congratulations to you for winning uh, singles here, mm -hmm. but also uh, winning doubles, right? No, no, no. He took that one. Oh, man, wait. I lied. <laughs> You're lying to the stream, man. What's oh, up? man, I guess it's time to rip. Oh, now I feel sad. Dang, I feel bad. I'm sorry, man. No, congratulations fine. to none for winning singles, though, over here. Dang. Yeah, we got, we got wrecked in uh Yeah, in what doubles. happened? Who won that? Uh, Javi, Javi and, and Asa. And, Asa. Yeah. and we took the yeah. picture, and then you guys were right next to, yeah. In, in, in tears. 
Oh. Well, guys, I guess that's it for the interview. I just, uh, <laughs> I guess we're, uh, we're about done here. But again, good stuff to none. For all you guys that like Captain Falcon and Ganondorf, please. Reach out to him. The guy has a Twitter. Yeah, you can catch me at, uh, it says below. Yeah, it says over there, at Nund with a D at the end. And that's a zero, by the way. That's not a no. Yeah, it's I definitely have a zero. That. I mean, it's, it's cool. It's cool. Yeah, it's cool. But, yeah, definitely check me out, guys, if you, you're into, like, my Falcon stuff. And um, I don't know. I guess, I guess I'll catch you guys later. All right, man. We'll see you guys later. And thanks again for hanging out with us here for Melee Singles. We're going to have Smash 4 underway.